A solar cell is essentially a p-n junction with a large surface area. The n-type material is thin to allow light to pass through to the p-n junction. Light travels in packets of energy called photons. The generation of electric current happens inside the depletion zone of the p-n junction. The depletion zone, as explained previously with the diode, is the area around the p-n junction where the electrons from the n-type silicon have diffused into the holes of the p-type material. When a photon of light is absorbed by one of these atoms in the n-type silicon, it will dislodge an electron, creating a free electron and a hole. The free electron and hole have sufficient energy to jump out of the depletion zone. If a wire is connected from the cathode n-type silicon to the anode p-type silicon, electrons will flow through the wire. The electron is attracted to the positive charge of the p-type material and travels through the external load creating a flow of electric current. The hole created by the dislodged electron is attracted to the negative charge of n-type material and migrates to the back electrical contact. As the electron enters the p-type silicon from the back electrical contact, it combines with the hole, restoring the electrical neutrality.